Hi all, so I'm just going to show you how to fold these little paper origami ninja stars. You only need two pieces of paper per star, um, but I, I like doing it with contrasting colours because I think it looks quite cool, so that's what I'm going to show you. But they're really simple and they're little fun stars for your kids. So, you want two pieces of origami paper of the same size. Now we're going to fold simultaneously, so we're going to take turns folding them because they're identical up to a point and then they become mirror images of each other so it's better to fold them together so you know you're getting the correct mirror image, okay? So the first thing I'm going to do is just fold the paper in half. Okay, and again, I'm using my bone folder because I find it gives me sharper image, um, edges. So we're just folding this paper in half. And then opening them both back up. Now we're going to take the ends, the edges of the paper and we're going to fold it into that centre line we've just created. So just pop that up and then Do the same on this one. And now we're going to bring these ones down the top edges down to the middle on both pieces. them up so just close the open flap into the inside of it so holding it in half with what's left basically and the back one. So now we both have these turn around so you've got the flaps down on the bottom now is when we start doing the mirror images so first thing we're going to do is fold in half and this first point is identical for both but after this we start doing mirror images so fold them in half open them back up now for this one we're going to fold this edge here so it goes along that centre line we just created, so we're folding this up. And then we're going to fold this top edge along that centre, so we're folding it down. And so for this one, as we folded this side up, we now need to fold it down for the mirror image. So again, the top edge will go down along that centre edge. And you probably guessed it by now, as this one folded down, it now goes up, so the bottom edge now goes along there. So now we have mirror images. Now I'm going to turn them over so we have it that way around. And we're just going to fold in a triangle across this line. Just pop them on. If you've got thicker paper like I have, it may take a little bit to try to get them to line up. doesn't matter if they're slightly off, we can watch job it later. So as we folded that one that way, we need to fold this one the opposite way. So they're now like that, and then we're going to do the same this way. So we're going to fold that down, <coughs> Oop, that way around. <laughs> So 
going to have that shape and so we're going to create the same thing so we're going to fold no <laughs> that way around and that one along there the opposite way so now we have mirror images again now take this top one and take this edge and fold it down that way and fold the bottom one up so we're creating this shape. I'm going to do the same on this one. So take that one down there. I'm going to take this edge along there so it goes up. It's getting a little thick on the paper about now so don't be surprised to see it struggles. And then unfold those two again because now we're going to line up. So we're going to turn this one over. See so we've got no um, this is a smooth side. We want to turn it over so we've got the folds because that's what we're going to fold into. So pop that under there so you can see now. Make sure you've got your flaps on that side so it's smooth edge against smooth edge there. And then we're going to fold this, tuck it into that flap. I'm going to fold this one and tuck it in to that flap. Now the first fold is easy, they just kind of slot in. But this is where it starts getting a little bit easier, because we're going to turn it over. Now we need to fold these ones into these flaps. So just open up that flap a little and tuck that down and in. And then give it a little wiggle to get it up snug because we've got to get to this flap which can trap itself under a little sometimes so we just need to get it up this is why we need to make it snug because we've got to now squish this one into that flap and it can be a little fiddly so just ease it around and in there we go look and again give your edges a nice little press so they're all secure and that is done there we go so it's pretty firm once it's in there it doesn't want to go anywhere because it is such a snug fit but that is all it takes to make a ninja star and you do them in all sorts of colours you have really good fun with them but I hope that's helped um, any questions pop it down below um, and check back soon for more origami videos take care bye